good morning, good afternoon, good evening, however, whenever, wherever this message may find you. I want to stop by and bring a message to you. I want to say to you, my people, be careful of the company you keep and the people you entertain. And the reason why I say this is because many people, when they don't have anything to lose, you will find them coming for you from every direction. But when you are invested in winning and being something great and You just know that there is something different that you want for your life and you are chasing that thing. Be careful of the company you keep and the people you entertain. Because when you are surrounded around like-minded people, those people will hold you accountable and they will elevate you in more than one way. But when you are surrounded around people who don't have anything to lose, their mind is not in the mind or on, in the direction in which you are trying to go. They will try you in every way. What am I saying? The Bible says that bad company corrupt good manners which means we have to be careful of the people we entertain and the company that we keep if you are trying to be something or somebody certain things you cannot allow yourself to entertain and I'm saying this because I'm speaking to myself because I'm guilty of this. Here it is. I'm in school for my PhD, right? I'm in school for my PhD. I have an awesome career. I'm, I'm going somewhere, right? I am a speaker, right? a lot of things going on for me and while I have these things going on for me it doesn't mean that life stops because life does not stop lifing throughout my process of what I'm going through or what I'm trying to obtain I still have to be careful of the people I entertain and the company I keep. And I'm saying this to you, my sister or my brother. Surround yourself around like-minded people. Because when you are trying to be something, when you are trying to go somewhere, people will come from every direction. They will, listen, pull up your past. They'll try to hold that over your head. But you got to understand that you are bigger than that. You are better than that. You do not allow little people, and I say little people because when people are coming for you, right? And they're trying to get you to step out of who you are, you're bigger than them. Because apparently you guys are not on the same uh, platform. You guys are not on the same page, right? And this is why I'm telling you, you got to know who you're entertaining. Because sometimes, I ain't going to say sometimes, a lot of times, we are entertaining the devil. And as we know, we don't play with the devil. Okay? So, I want you to understand. Be wise in your choosing. Your choice of words. What you say when you say it, how you say it. Because people, when you are trying to do things in your life and you're on a a, a, a path of um, 
success, right? Or you're trying to be successful, people will come for you. They'll dig up your past. They'll try to hold it over your head. And I'm sure many of you can relate. And I'm saying this, be careful of who you entertain. Be careful of the company that you keep. Okay, so until we meet again in the next video, I hope this video was um, motivation, motivational, inspiring, something, whatever it was. I want to challenge you to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my channel um, to hear more and more positive videos. Um, be great today okay if nobody told you that they love you i am telling you my sister or my brother in christ that i love you i love you even listen i love you okay with the love of jesus christ until we meet again in the next video bye be blessed